my mom had just recently passed away and I have multiple sclerosis and she was worried about me having family close and my brother's just through the path not even a block away. We took about four years to make this decision. We actually had looked at some other senior living places, even put some money down at a couple of other places. Well, we lived in our house in Bloomington for 47 years. And after 47 years, we decided we wanted to change. And we wanted to make things easier for us and easier for our children. There was an ad in the paper for Roseville. And I called the number and was greeted by such a wonderful young man who said, I'm sorry, we're not building in Burnsville, but we are in Bloomington. I was living alone and it got very lonely and I started looking around at some of these facilities. Initially, I saw it in the local newspaper and then a friend and I also started to talk about it and she mentioned that there was an open house, so we went to that together. I, I just love the location. My self-location means I'm uh, halfway in between Eden Prairie uh, Shopping Center, Mall of America, Burnsville Shopping Center, and Southdale. And I'm only about 10 minutes from the airport, which I really like. We came here in 1975, and we stay until now, so it's 47 years. So it's kind of hard to say goodbye to Bloomington. You can be as active as you want or not. There's just so many interests that are available to you, and it just feels like home. But I wanted to make sure that it's going to be a place that's going to be comfortable for me as an African-American male. You know, as, as a working musician, and as people have heard about what I do, I also do golf club repair. No matter what your religious background is, whatever your ethnicity is, whatever it might be, that this is more of a community that you are welcome to be a part of. They mean what they say, it's not just words. To me, Amira feels like a hotel. The decorator did a beautiful job. The amenities are wonderful. I mean, if there's not one kitchen or party room to reserve, really, there's like three or four. You now this whole rooftop area, this lounge area is beautiful, and it's, we've entertained up here once, and that was fun. I love the pool. That, that's a real plus for me. The outdoor pool, I've always enjoyed water. We've lived on lakes a good part of our life, and uh, even at my age, I still enjoy uh, going in the, in the pool. We have yoga, we have other exercise classes, we have pickleball. I'm not involved in that yet, but I know a lot of people really do enjoy that. Myself, I like to play pickleball. We have a pickleball court out here, and I do a lot of pickleballing. I have to say that the fire pits are my favorite, especially at nighttime. One of the amenities is the workshop that I've been somewhat involved in. When we need something, they've been able to order it, and that's been very helpful. Really, I can't say enough about the staff. Very responsive, and I, we, we'd not had an experience like this before. It's kept very clean. Uh, I think everybody takes pride. Everybody that works here, everybody that lives here, I think takes a lot of pride in this community. I, I feel very safe here. I'm up on the third floor. That feels good to me. When we bring people in, friends that come in and, and show them our apartment, they just can't believe what a beautiful place this is. People love to come to our place and my grandson said, Nani, you just have the coolest place ever. Pops, you've got it made here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah he's right. <laughs>